Hello, everybody. I swear, I think I wore this just the other day. Oops. Oh, well. Whatever. And I'm chomping on some gum. Sorry. It's part of it, right? You guys have to deal with me in all my weirdo-ness. Hmm. I need to push this because you know what I don't see? I can't see any comments on this thing right now. So I don't even know if anybody's here. That's not good. Hold on. I'm going to go to my page. Mm-hmm. Maybe that'll help. Okay. Where my bingo ladies be? It's so weird to watch myself up here. But you want to know what, y'all? Look what I got. Look, I printed it out and everything so I can check off what numbers we call. Mm-hmm. I'm smart today. Not like the last time we bingoed. Uh-oh. My phone's going to move. All right, everybody. So. Hmm. I do see one eyeball. Looks like, oh, we've got Ashley and Kathy. Hello, girls. How are you? Oh, hi, December. How are you, my friend? Hey, you know what? I do know that I need to get you your um, Santa shuffle packet. But, uh... I think I'm a little behind. Ah, oh, cousin-in-law. Love that. You're so sweet. Hey, Kathy, do you want to know what got mailed? Do you want to know? Your stand tall insert. Yeah! I know, we're all excited, aren't we? And your packet for the Santa Shuffle. Anyway, that's what I was saying. December, Santa Shuffle. Sorry. Um, it's. I promise it's going to come... I just need to put it together. I oh, know. It's been, it's kind of tough. I oh, know. Look at you, insert. Look, I see Jason Barry too. Where's your wife? I haven't seen her join. Is she here? Where is she? Candace, where are you? Let's see. Hey, guess what, you guys? Guess what, guess what, guess what? Candace is our brand new 31 consultant. Yay, Candace! I'm so excited. I mean, really, I'm super excited. Oh, there's Joshua. He's coming. I'm super excited, too. <laughs> He's clapping for you. Oh, y'all, look. That light back there? That's gonna blind you. Anyway. Oh, look. Josh dimmed it, except I think it's a little too dim, though. It hasn't gone up yet. Waiting. It keeps going up. It's not going up. I don't see it. Okay, that's fine. I see Priscilla's that's here. All the way at the top. You know that's oh. all the way at the top? Hey, oh. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, well, look. See, we're going to blind everybody, but look. Let's see. Candace said, thanks, Josh. See? He, oh, really, then, he meant it, too, my, though. My cousin and Kathy. Then, hey, Joshy. Here, look. You can get your head in there. There's Josh's head. Squish. Bigger than a bread basket. Totally bigger than a bread basket. You know what? I should probably show you Josh's head compared to like some of these products so then you really know. Ugh. Okay. So. He does have a big head. It's full of hot air. <laughs> Oh, do you, I'm glad you do, Priscilla. Yay. I'm so glad. Oh, you know what, y'all? Priscilla, Priscilla's name popping up just reminded me. Product premiere. Okay, I'm going to tell you guys just a little bit about that while we wait for everybody to get here. Um, so, how that works. So what we're going to do for product premiere is we're going to go to the movie theater. We're going to watch... Um, I don't know. I've never been to one, but I'm going to assume we get to watch a really great video um, showing all the new spring product line, and then we get a little goodie to take home with us, or at least I think maybe it's one goodie. I don't know. Maybe it's 20 goodies. Who knows? Anyway, um, now, for those of you who have just become consultants, because we've got a few, you know, we've got Reagan, we got Brooke, we got um, Candace today. Uh, we got Joy. All of you guys actually can sign up too. So make sure you go to TOT. For those of you that are consultants, you know what that is. 
go and get you some 31 tickets and then take somebody with you. So what I'm going to do is I'm really, I'm going to extend this offer to people who maybe are interested in joining 31 or the people who just love the product. So you guys, whenever you're pleading your case, let me know your reason, okay? All right, so we've got eight people here and I think we had something like 17, 18, somewhere in there, um, comment with their bingo numbers. I got a notification. You, like just now? No, I mean earlier. I'm just saying it went through. You know. So Josh is telling me he got his notification. I guess you guys did too. It says five minutes ago or so. Um, but you know what? Yay, mother-in-law's here too. And Reagan. Hi, Reagan. Ha ha. Okay, so yay. Okay, you know what? All right, good. Awesome. So we've got like 14 of you here. Um, oh, nope, just dropped 13. So anyway, I figure without much further ado, we should get started on our bingo. Now, y'all, I did get smart and I did write everything down. But what I didn't do was buy like one of those fun bingo things. So what I, I wrote down tickets, I wrote, or well, okay, I had Josh write down all like one through 25 on these tickets and that's how we're going to roll. Okay. So you guys ready to get started? Oh no, Heather, you're at work. Okay. You're going to be in and out. I'll tell you what, maybe as I go, well, yeah, as I go, I'll try to write down the numbers. How's that? Okay. We'll, we'll go that way. Good luck tonight. At least it's not a full moon, right? Okay. So, are you guys ready? Let's get this bingo game started, shall we? You ready? Um, okay. And number one is, I think that's a 21. Yeah, 21. It's backwards. See that? Josh has weird ones. Number 21. If you guys have it, comment, okay, so we can see. Oh, Tamara said hi to somebody named Taryn, and hi, Tamara. Hi. Mwah. Okay, but who's Taryn? I haven't met Taryn. Okay. Hi, in-law. Okay. Oh, hi, Taryn. Um, have you, um, did you pick your numbers? Did you happen to see that graphic that I posted earlier? By the way, number two, number one was not drawn. I didn't hit the actual, like, two before it. There you go. Okay. So. Yes, you did have to put your numbers on the post. But I tell you what, Taryn, since you're new, um, what I want you to do real quick while we go, um, right, uh, pick eight numbers, one through 25. With the, You cannot pick, though, because that is the one rule. You cannot pick the one we just called, which is number 21. And you cannot pick our free space, which is, does anybody remember what our free space was? Anybody? Number 10. Okay? I'm going to let you go ahead and put those in. Just get them done as quick as you can so we can get, so we can keep on going. While you write your numbers, I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys what number 21 is. And that is... Ba -dum -bum! What? Ten. Huh? Ten. Why'd you tell me ten? What'd I do? It was twenty-one. I'm confused. Anyway, okay. So, number twenty-one is the essential storage tote. No, it's not number ten. Not number ten. No, no, no. If you guys pick ten... You guys get to have it as a free space. Oh, thank you, Tamara. <laughs> hey, dear, it's hot in there. Um, okay, so it is. It's the free space. Thank you. I know. Whatever. You guys, it's been a long day. I was at work all day long. Um, so once um, you have all eight of your numbers called, you get a bingo. Yay. Okay. Taryn, you got your numbers done? Do you have them? Um, do you know them in your head? Do you have them written down? Make sure you guys do that. Make sure you have your numbers in front of me, okay? Or in front of you, okay? Um, Y'all, my husband joined again. Eh. 
Anyway, so make sure you have your numbers. Write those bad boys down, keep them in your little brains. When all eight of your numbers have been called, you get to yell bingo. Well, okay, you don't get to yell, but you get to type bingo in all caps if you want and yell at me. And, okay, there you go, Taryn, yes. Um, Joshua, quit it, I'm trying to give directions. Um, and then you're gonna get a prize, and we'll talk about what that prize is when you win it. Cool? Look, see, Kimberly, smart girl. All right, Tamara, you go get your numbers. I know you've seen the essential tote, so I'm gonna grab that, I'm gonna show everybody. Does everybody, does anybody have any questions on how to play bingo? Are we good? Yes. Okay, I'm gonna go. If you have questions, shoot them up there. Okay, so I gotta get back here and get all my goodies. All right, so I actually just got this one in. Awesome. Aw, Shanna, thank you. Paula, you need help? What you need help with? Holla at me. Let me know. I'll fix it. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this while, um, oh, girl, it's okay. Don't you worry. We don't have a whole lot of strict rules around here. You're all good. Oh, look at my husband. If two people call bingo at the same time, um, two people will get prizes. How does that, that sounds good, right? Yeah, we'll do it that way. Okay, so, yes, Kimberly, I know that, um, <laughs> I know that you would love this one. Look at all those dots. Isn't this awesome? Okay. Oh, we're playing bingo, Paula. Did you see it earlier? Let's see. Oh, Reagan. <laughs> no, really, it's kind of true. He's pretty darn awesome. I got lucky. Okay, so, you guys ready? You guys ready to talk about this tote now? <laughs> I think we've taken long enough. Okay, so, oh no, I'm still, wor I'm still going, Paula. You're in the live feed. You're good. We're with it. Okay, so, the essential storage tote. You guys remember this one. This is like those reusable um, grocery bags, except way, I was about to say way awesome or way more awesome, <laughs> way better. Um, there you go. See this? It's really great. This fabric, this will hold up through anything. I mean, I'm talking anything. I love it. It also has these grommets on it in the back. So if you wanted to get like, um, I don't know, like a, we had these little slit pockets and you wanted to slip that in here, it would work and would give you even extra pockets if you needed it. Perfect for the grocery store. It's really, I mean, it's essential, right? This is an essential tote. But what I was thinking for Christmas is, let's say maybe, maybe you do Secret Santa with your family. So you don't have like that $25, um, you know, thingy, you know, cap on your presents. Why don't you get one of these? And they are, look, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to go look real quick. They're 28. All right. Well worth every penny. I'm telling you. And then maybe stuff it full of tissue paper and call it its own present. Or, um, you can put other goodies in it. Let's say, you know, maybe you don't want to do the memory pouches and you want to put pajamas and movies and books and stuff in there for your kids. I figured you wanted it, Kimberly, because those dots are so cute. This is in the Navy Dancing Dot. See? And you get that cute 31 logo on there. I'm a fan. Uh. <laughs> Joshua, you don't get it. I bet beer would fit in it too, Candace. I bet it would, except that it's not a thermal, so you couldn't put ice in there. That's kind of the bummer, right? Okay, I'm sorry if I'm blinding you guys with this light. All right. There we go, essential tote. Are you ready? I could give it to you for Christmas? <laughs> Maybe I could. I bet I could do that. I might need it in my life too though. I do like those dots. You know, I'm a super polka dot girl. Anyway, all right, you guys ready? Let's get our second one and I might actually just leave this down and not pick it up. Oh y'all yeah, look, except I smeared it. K plus J to the moon. Oh, I know. Okay, 
Are you ready? What's our other number? 14. 14. All right, I'm going to type this in the comments. Who has number 14? <laughs> yes, Secret Santa. <laughs> You're cracking me up, sister. Okay. So, number 14 is the Gather Together gift bag. And y'all, don't worry. I'm checking them off this time, I promise, so we can go back. And I'm writing them in there for you. Yay, look at you, Taryn and Candace. Girls, look at that. Watch y'all. It's Taryn's first night here, and she's going to... Oh, don't you boo me, Diana. And she's going to win. Okay, so this is the Gather Together gift bag. I don't know if any... Have you guys seen this? Did I show this? Okay, so what I did on this one is I put our really cute Christmas Joy on there. Now, I didn't get the, the font below, but you could put like Joy to the World, Joy Brings Peace. I don't know. <laughs> that didn't make any sense, did it? You could do whatever you want with the Joy. Or, I mean, you can get a number of any of our other um, um, embroidery options on there. So there you go. I'm sorry you don't like my numbers, Carol. I'm sorry. Well, Diana, I'm trying to give you joy. Yes, Kimberly, that's where we're going with this. I think this she's is. About my numbers. What are you? Oh no, that, she's not talking about your numbers. No. Uh -huh. hmm. Okay. So perfect wine bag. Yes, ma'am. That's exactly what I would have thought. Perfect wine bag. Um, so, I mean, you can put somebody's initials on this thing if you want, give them, um, some wine, call this their bag and their gift, right? Um, also this might be handy for like the male teachers who might not want a little scary all caddy. Maybe they don't like camo. This would be great too. You can put, um, some teacher supplies in here. Look, genius, right? I love this thing. I think it's really, really cute. Um, and it is only... <laughs> $12. So this really is one of those good and expensive gifts. It would be perfect to fill stuff for um, like Secret Santa at work, whatever. You know what I mean? Th this wine bag or Boone's Farm for Josh. <laughs> <laughs> he is like a child. <laughs> Diana. Oh, sorry, Diana. This is called the Gather Together gift bag. I think it has like the word latte in it somewhere, but if you put in gathered together, you'll find it. Okay. Moving on. You ready? Y'all, I am. I'm just, I'm going to pull them out over here because you don't need to see that every time, do you? Look at this. Number one. Who's got number one? Anybody? Look, see that typo that I made earlier? Now it actually is. We actually had number one. Does anybody have one? Oh, did nobody? Really, Kathy? Oh, look at you. And y'all, oh my gosh. We're probably gonna be done with bingo before I get through any of these numbers, huh? <laughs> okay, so the Avenue scarf. And I know that I put this on for you guys and you've seen it. Um, if I don't know, December, are you here? Oh, yay, Priscilla! Okay, um, y'all, this is the softest, y'all quit bullying me. Anyway, it's the softest scarf ever, 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 okay? I mean, like, and you can do all sorts of stuff with it. I don't know if you can see, like, it's called, it's an avenue scarf, so you can wear it like a shawl, see? And I'm all warm. I can put it over my head. Look, look, let's say you're getting married. You need a cheap veil, there you go. Or somebody needs to be Little Red Riding Hood. I don't know, there you go, see? It's really, it's really cute. And this is like Dillard's quality, super softness. I don't know, see here, um, let me show you. See this here, I don't know if you can, it looks blurry, but kind of that little fringe down there. I know, isn't it the best name? It's so sweet. Oh, y'all, I messed up my hair. Yes, I know, I am looking like a yeah, yeah, a little bit. That's okay, though. They're cute. <laughs> okay, so 
The Avenue Scarf, it's only $28. This is great for any of the ladies in your life. We have beautiful prints to choose from. Yes, December got hers for a gift. Ha ha, you're gonna keep it, aren't you? Did you feel it? It's so pretty. And she got the Checkmate. You guys, the Checkmate is the perfect pattern for fall and winter, I think. Now, I do love this one. The name escapes me, but I love it. Boom, there you go. Uh-oh. Oh no. It can also be used to choke your wife. Well, why would you do <laughs> Why would you do that? He's mean. Boo. Everybody's Boo. booing you. They're not booing me. <laughs> They're they, booing you now. They love me. They boo, boo him. You. Boo. <laughs> okay, whatever. On to the next one. Navy pendant. Diana. See? I know, Shanna, you should love it. Look, Diana should be a consultant, y'all. First of all, she loves hers in 31. She really loves her some personalization. Candace, you thought you love personalization? Oh, no. Oh, no, Diana. Diana would monogram anything that moved. Thank you, December. Yay. Okay. Look, see? Tamara's got my back and December both. Ha <laughs> ha. Boo. Okay. All right, y'all ready? Let's see. I don't know if you can hear me digging. I'm trying to like be good. All right, number lucky 13. Is that lucky in your world? I don't know. Let's see, is it lucky for anybody? All right, let me type it up in here. We'll find out who lucky number 13 is or what rather. Okay. You ready? Where is it? It's somewhere. I don't know what I did. There it is. Oh, <gasps> holy moly. Kathy and Heather. You crazy girls. Oh my gosh. How close are you guys? How many do you have left? Okay, so we know lucky number 13 is the Littles Carry All Caddy. Y'all, have I shown you? I finally got my reindeer. Look at these ears. Look at. Do you see these ears? They're so cute. But let me show you something else. You guys know this strap on the back? Look, you can tuck his little ears up under there later. And look, you can turn him into a monkey. So you can have it out all year long if you don't love reindeer all year long. What? A monkey. Yes. You turn a reindeer into a monkey. Look, that looks like a monkey, doesn't it? Yes, it does. <laughs> Yes, see, look, antlers. Aren't they cute? Okay, so you guys know how this works. You've got the strap. So that's what makes it a carry-all, right? Because you can carry it around. Unless you don't have little tiny people in your life that don't need to carry stuff around, then you can just tuck it in the back, just like this. Take the silica gel out. Don't need it, take it out. It's gonna be in all of these. And then you get this little nice mesh pocket in the back. Oh, maybe a bear. Maybe a bear more than a monkey. That makes more sense, huh? Oh, but it's so cute. I love this thing. <laughs> Kimberly's smoking like a true saleswoman. Uh-huh. Okay. I love this thing so much. So what I'm thinking for this for Christmas gifts, first of all, we've talked about it before, but teachers. All right, you can fill this full of tiny bottles of wine and chocolate. Every teacher I have talked to, Amy Mayo, are you here? Cousin Amy, are you here? You know that's what you want in this guy, okay? You want wine and chocolate. But let's say you don't wanna give your teachers wine. You guys, put all their favorite pens, put some Sharpie markers, fill it full of all those fun little office supplies that you know teachers need. It's perfect. Um, now, you can't personalize the reindeer, but if I could, I have so much stuff over there, but if I could show you, um, you can personalize these. So you can put their last names on them, whatever you wanna do. Look how cute it is. You know you want one. You guys have all seen my Santa too. I know you have. Look, he makes me happy with his antlers. Okay. Oh, and look, they're like felt. See? It's like velvet. Uh, Yo, I asked Josh if he wanted to draw the numbers for me and he said, mm, no, I'm not feeling very good. I just, I don't, I don't feel good. Now he's sitting in the living room being the backseat driver to my Facebook Live video. Boo. Okay, what's next? Yes, yeah, see, 13 is unlucky. Yours look delicious. 
<laughs> okay, you ready? All right. Number. You guys, you ready? You ready? You ready? Y'all, I see my cousin. Amanda, did you join? My cousin? Are you still here? If you are, say hi. Okay. No eight numbers when all eight of your numbers have to be called because I'm mean. Mm -hmm. You ready? Okay. Number 11. Who's got number 11? Yay, number 11. And we'll see what we got over here. Ooh, I know. Hey, look, Kimberly, this is another one of your favorites. I know that if you had seen it, you probably would have um, said something. Holy moly, are you serious? Wow. All right, girls, this competition's like it's heating up and stuff. I know they wouldn't be the same without Josh. Eh, it's okay. You know we love him. Okay, number 11, the Glamour Case. I know you guys have seen it. I know most, a lot of you have, have bought this thing. Okay, remember, this fabric. See, hear that? That means you can wipe stuff off of it. Also on the inside, it's got this plastic. You can wipe stuff out of it. You know you need that in your life because look, if you're like me and you use brushes for your makeup, look, you got this little flap, boom. But you can wipe it off. Oh, see, oh, Heather, you did get yours, didn't you? Yes, oh girl. So what I love is that, let's say you don't love this for a makeup case or something like that, you can put, you can put jewelry in it, Kimberly. Um, it's also got this big zipper pocket right here. Um, when Diana and I went to see Dave Ramsey, I actually took this with me in my suitcase and I fit all of my makeup, which as you can tell is not much, but I fit all my makeup, all my brushes, including my hairbrush, all in this guy. And, okay, see, like, it's really deep. I should put stuff in it so you guys can see, but then when I got home, I took everything out, and then I went smish, 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 and it doesn't take up space in my drawer. What? I was just going to tell everybody that I really married up. You know? <laughs> and you, you have low standards. I mean, look at, I have high look at you and look at me. Oh, You're handsome. Oh. Mwah. Okay. Sorry, we had to get all the lovin's. You get paid on the 25th. Okay, well, you, girl, you get this. And you know what? Getting paid on the 25th is good. You guys are going to be so excited when you see, I mean, like, the December specials rule. I'm not going to lie. So, anyway, get you one of these, Kimberly. Glamour case. And it is, it's only 25 bucks, which is really great. This is good for the Kimberly's in your life or teenagers, for real. Oh, don't you yak me. You know you love it. Um, great for teenagers. Let's say maybe you have a, a girl who's turning 15 and you're allowing her to wear makeup for the first time. Get one of these and put it in there. Then you know that she's got a place to put all of her makeup. Or they're also good for the me's because I have to travel. Anybody who likes to travel, this is good. This is a perfect gift and it's fairly inexpensive and it's going to last you forever because it's a 31 product. We all know that they last forever, right? All right, let's see. Oh, <laughs> God, you crack me up. Didn't you? Didn't your mama just get you lots of really, really great stuff? Did she? Oh, I hope that wasn't a secret. Y'all, dang it. Okay, I'm gonna draw the next one. You didn't hear that? Okay, you ready? All right, number twenty. It's backwards, but that's okay. You guys know what I mean. Number 20. What you got? You ready? Okay. And while I'm waiting on you guys to tell me, you guys have seen it. You know you love it. The around town tote. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you this. Okay. Let's see. Oh, I'm sitting on a ticket. Have we called it? No, and I'm sitting on one. Whoops. Oh my gosh. Look at you guys. Okay, oh. Oh yeah, did you get the glamour case? Is that what you're talking about, Miss Simber? Okay, go. Around town tote. <gasps> Look how pretty it is in the very cherry pebble. And I wish you guys could really see this color. I'm not, I'm not lying. It's beautiful, okay? See, look. Watch this. Mm -hmm. You just put that bad boy on you like that. Boom. I take this with me to work. I take this with me when I go on client calls. I take this everywhere I go. 
And then also remember, one of my favorite things, because it is such a ginormous tote, you know what you need? A place to put your cell phone right there in the back so it doesn't fall to the ground. It's amazing. I love it. I love this bag. And come on, Kimberly, you're with me on the polka dots. Look at those pretty polka dots in there. And you guys know how 31 bags work. I know you all do. Uh, I don't want to move my phone because if I do, then I'm never going to get it back where it was. Okay. You've got the two little pockets, right? And then you got the zipper right there. It's a huge zipper pocket. It's the best bag. Get you one. Get you one. Okay. Let's see. What am I missing? Um, which one? The uh, the around town tote? Does that come in black? Okay, you know what? I'm going to look real quick. How's that? You guys are just going to have to deal with like seeing up my nose and my crazy eyeballs. Hmm. Okay, it doesn't come in black, but it comes in this city charcoal pebble. And that gray is so pretty. Um, my friend Kara just got um, a hobo in the gray, and it's a beautiful color. So, there you go. Yeah, see, Carol, you know all about those polka dots, too. I love them. They're so cute. You only need three more numbers? Holy mackerel. Y'all, my husband is hearting away, isn't he? Is that him hearting? Okay, hearting. That's like Texas slang. Okay, for he loves me. All right, let's see. You ready? Oh, see? Yay, Kimberly. <gasps> Miss Hennessy's here too. Oh, but you didn't do numbers, but that's okay. I get to see your little pretty picture pop up. See, I'm pointing right there. It's right there. Okay, you ready? What's our next number, girls? Number three. Diana, have I not called any of your numbers yet? That's funny. All right, number three. Let's see what we've got. Y'all, this one's, I mean, these are really useful, but it's a boring one. However, makes for a great gift, not gonna lie. You guys ready? Oh, none for Tamara either, but you know what? You girls, you guys just, you just got presents. Diana, have you gotten your pillow? Look at this, y'all. This is the, would you quit bowing me, husband? Arr! You're coming home? Like for good? You're coming home? <gasps> Yay! Oh, crap. I didn't put I didn't put our number three in there. There you go. Okay. Look at this. Sorry for saying crap. Hang it up, key fob, y'all. And this is the preppy pop. I don't have a whole lot of stuff in this pattern. I don't know why, because look how pretty and bright it is. I like it a bunch. Um Oh, okay, after I talk about this key fob, we're gonna, we'll go over those numbers again, okay? Just in case. All right, so, now, I work in a building that has this um, gate that we have to use, one of those little beep beep things to get in, technical term, beep beep, and, which means that I either have to take my key out of the ignition to swipe it, or I have to have a key fob. Now, and I know all of you teachers know all about these key fobs, right? I know you do. Because um, they're vital. They are vital to your existence. Plus, this one's so pretty. So, key fob. These are only, I'm going to tell you in like two seconds, these are only $5. So, they make great um, stocking stuffers. You know kids love key fobs too. So, if you need them, stock up. They also make... Um, I mean, really, they make kind of cool little gifty things, especially those of you who are in direct sales or anything like that. This is good for the business, ladies. Get you some key fobs. Okay, there we go. All right. Oh, that's funny. You talked about the thermal drive. <laughs> You're so sweet. I'm sorry. I, I'm glad you liked the pink. I wasn't sure if you'd love pink or not, but I knew you wanted one of those thermal totes. So thank you for being one of my hostesses of the month. You guys are the best. You say fob a lot, fob, 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 fob. Aw, Kara. Hmm. Thank you. You're so pretty, too. 
Thank you. You guys just can't see the mess that's going on right now. Plus, I'm getting hot in here, so I think my face is sweating. It's okay, though. Let's see. Tamara, so why not just leave it in the console? Oh, well, because when we go in and out, which, okay, so you know in sales, like, I got to leave the building a whole lot. or I mean, or let's say I go outside and I need to come back in because our cell phones don't work in the building either. Huh? I have to have my key fob to get in the door too. So I have to take it with me wherever I go if I want to leave the building. It's a lot of fun. Um, yes, if you clip it on the ring, you can put it on your wrist. Mm -hmm. You certainly can. It also clips on all of our 31 bags. And I would totally show you how that works if I could get to a number that showed you one of the 31 bags that it clips on. Just saying. Okay, you guys ready? Uh, number... 24. How are we doing, ladies? Are we getting close? Let's see what number 24 is. Ooh, and this one has stuff in it. That's fun, because this one's been in Oliver's room. Hey, wait, let's see. All you mamas and not mamas, anybody who knows anything about toys, what's the sound? Something you don't want to step on. That's your hint. Oh, oh, that's funny. No, yeah. I would keep it in my console if it was to enter the neighborhood, but girl, I'm not that fancy. Come on now. Okay. Oh, don't do, I'm sorry, you're doing awful. Okay. What was that number I just called? It is the, oh, you guys, before I get to that, yes, see, Kathy knows and Jason. It's totally Legos. You know because you don't want to step on it. Let's go through these numbers real quick, okay? So we've got number one, the Avenue Scarf for $28. You got the Hang It Up Key Fob, that's number uh, three. Number three for five. Oh, I'm sorry. Joshua Grissom. Okay. You've got the Glamour Case for 25. That's number 11. The Littles Carry All Caddy for 12. That's number 13. Yes, I'm naming all the numbers right now, Miss Reagan. Gather Together gift bag for $12. That's number 14. The Around Town Tote for 78. That's the number 20. The Essential Storage Tote. Don't be weird. It is $28. And that's number 21. And all in, uh, this last one that we just haven't gotten to yet, the All-in-One Organizer for 20. That's number 24. So you ready? Let's go through these. Here, Joshua, you tell the numbers with the check marks. Be useful. Oh, he can't see. It's too dark in here. <clears throat> I'm old. Mm hmm. One, three, 11, 13, 14, uh -oh. 20, 21, and 24. My backwards? That's official. I think my numbers are backwards. There you go. Those are the official numbers. Okay. All right. So we are now on the, which one was it? The all-in-one organizer. Okay. So I'm going to show you guys. This is, this is how we're, we're doing it in our family. This is in the checkmate. Remember that scarf? We have it in this pattern. This is the one I was telling you about. I had it. Oh yeah. I kind of thought so. And then I went backwards. That's fine. Whatever. I don't care. I don't care. Okay. So You've got these nice mesh pockets on both sides, right? You guys know this. And then, this is where Oliver, see, that's where he's putting all of it, like the um, the booklets to tell him how to do. Oh, uh, this is the number 24. Um, tell him how to do the Legos, see? And then on the inside, and you know, this is, a, this is actually a pretty massive Lego set in here. See? Legos. Okay. Let's see. If I set this down, can you guys see? Look at that prettiness. What happened to I just, uh, I hit something. Anyway, all in one organizer. So this is great. This is great for just about anybody in your life. Mother-in-law, she might need some something to put like, I don't know, kitchen gadgets in that she needs to store so that her daughter-in-law doesn't steal them. Or, um... 
I don't know, kiddo, to put Legos in. You could fill this guy full of all their favorite Legos and use it as a gift bag under the Christmas tree. Um, this is also good for husbands who like to go disc golfing. Also good. Josh is so noisy, Kara, and you know, I don't, I don't deal well with like the external noises. Very, oh, I just don't. He makes me, I mean like, I don't know, makes my ADD a little crazy. Anyway, I should pop him, shouldn't I? Oh yeah, bag for garden tools. <gasps> Ooh, yeah. Well, you know what? Okay, Aunt Law, we have the best bags for garden tools. You know what those large utility totes are good for? Garden tools. Um, also the medium utility tote, that's the, one of the hostess specials. Mm-hmm, garden tools. We've got all sorts of good ones, but there you go. Ha ha, your mom said she agrees with Kathy and said, pop you. I'm gonna pop him. <laughs> anyway, there you go. There's your all-in-one organizer, everybody. All right, let's see. Let's get another number, shall we? <clears throat> Little do they know, I kind of like getting popped every once in a while, so, you know. Knuckle sandwich. Uh, that one very good, was it? Wasn't satisfying for me either. You guys ready? Number 22. 2-2. Two, two. Who's got it? There we go. Number 22. Um, and that is the folding file. Of course it is because it's inside. I'm going to show you guys this one because it's here. Oh, heavy. Um, well, what would you think about um, the zip top utility tote for that, Paula? See, since it's got the three pockets in the front, two in the back, and then the two mesh pockets on the side. Yay, Carol! Carol's got 22! And Priscilla? Yes, okay, so, um, and the reason why I picked up the zip top, or the zip top organizing utility tote is out for short, that's what I'm totally gonna call it, um, is because my folding file is inside here. But you guys also remember the Zout. For every $35 you spend, and it's one of the best Christmas presents ever, ever, ever on the planet. You guys know, all of you have one, you know. Um, it is only $10 for every $35 you spend. That's like 70% off. Pretty awesome. Okay, but your fold and file. Any teachers, anybody who works in an office, anybody who has a house and they like to keep things organized, um, even teenagers who need to keep all their stuff separate for school, this is your go-to. Because look, you have this right here that you can put all your pens in if you need to. If you are a consultant of any kind, you can put your business cards. You can do all sorts of stuff with this, as you can see in mine. I have a lot of my um, clipboards for home parties, and then I've got my paper. I've got all sorts of stuff in here. So, there you go. Oh, good, Carol. I'm glad you did. Yes. No, it's awesome. These are the best. And this one is only, this is 25. So, see, you could get this one and then, like, two key fobs. You're right there at the 35, and you can get yours out for 10. Boom. Christmas problem solved, y'all. This would actually also probably be pretty good to put all your bows and ribbons in for Christmas. I think the Zout would actually be even better. Yes, Reagan, Scentsy. Oh my gosh. What is that smell that I like? What is it that, the, uh, I don't know. But Reagan, I'm addicted to Scentsy. I'm addicted. And that darn toaster is so cute. Okay, anyway, sorry. Sidetracked. Okay. About which ones? The, um, oh, the Zao and the, the, all, the fold and file? You should totally get them for real. They are, um, it's, it's probably my favorite combo that we have because they fit inside each other. So, yes, it is a man's one. Southern evening. There you go. Okay. Let's do another one. Y'all ready? Bum, bum, bum. Okay. Number 16. Who has number 16? Anybody? Hmm. I 
got distracted by my own video that's showing above my head. 16. Southern evening, yes. Okay, Paula, if you want to, we can FaceTime or something later. Um, and I can show you a little bit more in detail if you need me to. Yay! Look at that, Taryn! Yo, really, it is. It's her first night. And Kathy? Girls. And Kimberly, too. They all picked the right numbers. It seems like they all picked the same numbers. <laughs> Did you guys pick the same ones? We'll have to see. Okay. So, number 16. Oh, you guys haven't seen this one because I just got it in. The Wall Together Pin Board. I am... An awesome super fan. You ready? So we have this one. And it also comes where it has like these pockets. The three pockets. And I think that one I ordered and is coming. But I wanted, I really wanted this one first. So. Uh, I have called 21. Yes ma'am Priscilla. I have called 21. But this one is number 16. I know Heather. I'm sorry. Bummer. Oh I'm sorry. So this one is in the charcoal crosshatch. We also have it in the taupe dancing dot. So for those of you who love that color, which you know I do, it's actually the one that Josh wanted me to pick, and I didn't. Um, I wish that I uh, had been able to pin stuff on here so that you guys could see. Um, but look, doesn't that pretty? That's I think this is the um, I think this is the aqua that I picked, and not the true turquoise. But I really love it. This is what I'm going to use to pin up all. Um, uh, because of all of you awesome super ladies, I have been the number one salesperson in my team for the last two months. So I've gotten all sorts of like really fun um, gift, or not gift cards, but like postcards and hey, way to go Katie and all those things. So I'm going to put them all on here because I think it's really fun. And <coughs> I'm sorry. Eh. Um, it's only 20 bucks. So this is not bad. If you have the personalization for seven, you're looking at a $27 gift. So this is good. I mean, you can see here, um, I've had what, like we've seen like four people who have said, I want one of those. Rest assured, if you give somebody one, they will find a place to use it. Maybe it's in their office. Maybe it's, um, maybe it's at home. They just need some place to put all this stuff. Um, it's really good. I love it. Yeah. Meh. Oh, that's okay. It's okay. Heather, you know what? I'm actually about to run through the numbers again. Did you um, did you pick your bingo numbers? If you did, it's okay. I don't mind. No worries. We can, we can go through them, okay? All right, so there you go. This is an awesome gift, y'all. Grab you one. And at $20, not half bad. Am I right? I'm right. Okay, let's see. We need to draw another number. I'm gonna wait for Heather to tell me if she picked her numbers or not. Okay. Oh, and by the way, thank you, Priscilla. I just saw your comment. And Kimberly, thank you. You guys are awesome. It's really, it's because of you guys. You guys are very supportive and wonderful and you listen to me ramble on these live videos all the time and I love you for that. So, okay. Is this lucky? Lucky number? 19, huh? Who needs number 19 in their lives? Oh, I'm glad we picked this one too. Okay, so number 19 is the mini zipper pouch. I love this one. And I'm actually not that glad because it's the big zipper pouch that I needed. Um, but here you go. See? Look. Okay, so I've got some stuff in here. You can see, <gasps> Kimberly, you got bingo? No way. Look at you go, sister. Oh, yeah, Kimberly won the bingo. No, you can't edit the comments. <laughs> okay, way to go, sister. Ah, all right, so, Kimberly. Oh, Heather, yes, yes, yes. And let me tell you real quick before I get on to congratulating Kimberly and telling her that she's so awesome and wonderful and what she won. I'm going to tell you. So this one, the mini zipper pouch, it's only $12. Only $12, which is super duper fantastic. No, it's all eight numbers. You have to have all eight numbers. Hmm. 
Okay, I take it back. We're going to rewind. Uh-oh. We're going to rewind. We're going to get excited again because somebody's going to call bingo, I promise. Okay? All right, so the mini zipper pouch. And, y'all, so I got the arrows. I love these arrows a lot. I think they're super cute. And you can get it where you get, like, um, your initials on either side or you can do, like, J and K. <laughs> Oh, do y'all see Kathy? She used the poop emoji. <laughs> hey, don't be sorry, Kimberly. That's all right. I think that actually happened last time. And um, the girl that did it, she ended up winning. So it works. Oh, no, it's, yes, this is perfect for pins. If you, like, do you need it in, do you need it in a bag or, <gasps> don't you arrow me? Mm. Mean. Okay. Anyway, so. Um, we also have, I'm gonna, I shouldn't, I shouldn't go out of order. The big zipper pouch. Also good if you, if you need it in a bag, but then you saw this, the your way bin, the one that I've been pulling, um, all my tickets out of super good for pins. And I know that I'm supposed to use 31 stuff, but you can also get a Darth Vader cup and you can use that for pins. Mm -hmm, totally can. Okay. <laughs> You're probably a little bit right about that, Tamara. But see, what I figured is with eight numbers, then maybe we can show most of the things I need to show, right? He's a total mess, Kathy. Mm-hmm. That grissom boy. Okay. Nope, Taryn, not over. Mm -mm. Let's keep going. Let's see. How long have we been going? Does anybody know? Almost an hour. Oh, almost an hour. Okay, I'm going to go faster. We're going to stop talking. Okay. Number nine. Does anybody need number nine? Next time I'll do five. We'll do five next time. Okay, the Midway Hobo. You guys have seen this one. My, okay. Hey, Kara, if you're still here, mute me. Okay, mute me. I'm going to give you about one minute. This is my favorite purse, you guys, and it is unzipped. I'm sorry, so you can't really see how, like, well it hangs, but you remember I was telling you also about this right here. You get the cell phone pocket in the back. Yay. I love this, and it also comes in that really pretty very cherry pebble, which I would have gotten, but I didn't. Um, it has standard 31 pockets in it. So Kara got this one for her daughter, who is a teenager, I think this is the perfect bag for a teen. It's also the perfect bag for a mom. It's the perfect bag for um, a, a fur baby mama. It's this is a this is a really nice bag. Plus, it's this nice kind of like leathery materially stuff, and I love it. I wish I really knew what it was called, but I don't. I mean, I know it's called the Midway Hobo. I know that part. Um, okay, so and the Midway Hobo is. Hold on, I'm getting there. What number was it? 78, okay? All right, let's go to the next one. I'm sorry. I'm sorry it's been an hour. Holy moly. It's because I haven't seen you guys and been able to do these in so long. Number 18. Who needs number 18? Let's see what number 18 is. Yay. Timeless memory pouches. You guys know we've talked about these. What are we going to do with these? And the Swirl Dot, we're going to give our family their dream vacation of going to Disneyland, okay? We're going to put it in here. We're just going to go whoop, like this, right? Boom. It's like its own little sack. You can put there all your tickets and stuff to Disneyland. And if you do that, take me with you. Josh doesn't have to come. It can just be me, okay? Then you have this other little one. Perfect. <gasps> yes, ma'am, Heather. You need your eight numbers. Um, and then in this little one... You can do, uh, maybe you're like me and you have these teenager boys in your life who only want gift cards. Oh, see, I love that print too, Kathy. I think it's good all year round, not gonna lie, because it's like Minnie Mouse. Uh, gift cards, jewelry. Also, y'all, 31 has jewelry. I just have not been able to um, put it in my, um, mm hmm forgot what I was doing there. Oh, I just haven't been able to put it in my budget yet, but... The jewelry is very great. So there you go. This one. Put some jewelry in it. Perfect for those stocking stuffers. Okay. And then, you guys know it's my favorite, the Santa. 
because he's so cute. All right, same with the other ones. Look, you just draw a string that bad boy like this. And this, yes, Miss Tamara, Christmas Eve gift. This is what we're gonna do in our house. Um, and ever, all these girls have really great ideas for, for stuff like that. Hot chocolate, a movie, your favorite Christmas book, uh, pajamas, anything like that, put that in here and they can open their gift on Christmas Eve. I love it. I love these bags. And the beauty, they're five dollars. Only five. Okay, so I mean you can use these even as gift wrap if you need to. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh yeah, Kathy, so you got Reagan. Okay, yes, it was number 19. I know. It's terrible. So cute. Okay. What's next? Let's go. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna quit saying sorry. Number 15. 15. Let's see what we get. Bingo! You do not have bingo. He did not pick numbers. Y'all don't listen to him. <sighs> all right, the large utility tote. Uh, you guys have all seen this. Taryn, I don't know if you have, but I'm gonna see this large, oh, this large utility tote. <laughs> now, this would make a great gift. Whoop! Uh, I tucked the handles inside and made my stand tall insert go bananas. Anyway, um, so you see this? This would make a great gift, but what this is also good for, let's say you're gonna go to your grandma's house, your yaya's house, and you need to tote presents back, uh, you know, you need to take presents there to give to everybody, and you need to take them home, you put them in there because it is awesome. The sound is gone. Hey, Joshua, turn up your thing. I don't have the oh. Kimberly, is the sound still gone? Is it really? Hold on. Oh, I'm gonna open this, I'm gonna hear myself. Oh, well I have to turn it up. Okay, so. Oh, I'm gonna open this, I'm gonna hear myself. Eek. Okay, I did it. You're gonna be a teacher? Oh, what, what are you gonna teach? And yes, yes you do. Can I tell you, I think 31 was made for teachers. If my girl Joy was here, mm -hmm, it is. Okay, let's see. Okay, you can hear. Oh no, okay, you know what? Just get out and then come back. Yes, I think Reagan and Lutz are, they're the best. I think that they're usually number one on the, um, on everybody's list, just because you can use them for anything. And you can even get the top of tote, which I have, but I'm not gonna show you for time's sake. Second or fifth, go for second, they're sweeter. No, I'm just kidding, no, either one is good. Okay, y'all, I grabbed another one. Number 17. Well, good luck to you. Hopefully you'll stay in this group a long time and you'll keep me updated. All right, number 17, the Your Way Bin. Y'all, that's this one. See, we've already seen it, so now you know. Hey, you know, remember, you can get this bottom part, you can get it in pink, or you can get it just in um, this you know, neutral color all the way down. Awesome, it has this cute little chalkboard thing, and so you can tell I smeared mine. Whoops, sorry. Um, yeah, God bless her for real. <laughs> okay, so you got this bin. Now, um, dang it, we took all of our Sharpies out, but I think we got like 25 Sharpies, and there's still room in here for more. You can fit a ton of stuff in here. This is perfect for your desk. I use it on mine. It's also good in bathrooms. I know that um, Lauren, really, she uses hers for all of her remote controls. It's super cute. I love it. Um, Plus the chalkboard. We love the chalkboard, right? Okay. Y'all, did you guys all pick the same numbers? Somebody has to have one. Somebody has to have a bingo. Oh, you know what? Um, Taryn, you have a twin. You're cool. That's awesome. Yes, uh, you invite her and I'll just approve her. Okay, so whenever we're done, invite her, okay? Yes, Miss Reagan, we have called number nine. All right. Number 23. Who needs number 23 to call the bingo? Bingo. No, Joshua. He's not a bingo winner. He's not even a bingo player. Okay. You guys have seen, you know what? To save time, you've seen Lucy's. Let me show you the one that I just got in for Chloe. Look. 
No, no, this is number, um, what number did I just say? Uh, number 23, the mini gathered together apron. Okay, look at this. Yo, she loves Paris. So, this is what I did. The heart is so cute on the apron. And if you can see, it's really, it's a perfect size for your littles. You can adjust this here. The straps are, they're short enough or they can, I mean, this is going to fit both my girls. I have one that's super duper tiny and one that um, is older. So she's not quite as tiny. There you go. Um, we also have, it has a pocket right here. So you can, I'm sorry you can't hear. Oh, uh, I'm going to put her in here. Okay. You think you have bingo? Yes. Okay. Can you guys hear me? One, three, nine, eleven, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three. Somebody's got to have a bingo. You're bound to. Yeah, Carol, I think she will too. I think that it might be fun. Um, now, I think this would be a great gift. But um, Josh isn't letting me give it to them as a gift because he thinks that we need to use it. Um, okay, I'm typing. Hold on. Okay. One, three, nine, eleven, thirteen. Through. Okay, anyway, I think this would make a great gift. We also have them in the big kid size, AKA me, and I collect aprons. I have, just haven't gotten mine yet. Um, so Christmas would be perfect for, um, for, your, for all the kids, uh, I, I don't know, for, for a mom or for all the littles in your life who enjoy cooking in the kitchen with mom or maybe you just wanna be sweet and get everybody aprons, I don't know. I love aprons, they're really sweet. They make me happy. Ask my mother-in-law, she gets me a lot. Okay, all right, what's next? Oh, I'm sorry, Kimberly. We've called like all of them. All right, number eight. Who's got number eight? And what is number eight? Oh, I'm so happy to show you guys this because I just got it, it's the Swap It Pocket in the Medallion Medley. Now listen, see, this is that same number. I mean, number, it's the same fabric. You can wipe it off. You just put this down in your purse. Fits in big purses or little purses, okay? You've got a zipper right here on the side. Yay, Paula's got one and Tara, Darren. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Look, so you've got a pocket on this side. You've got one just like it on the other side. It buttons in the middle just to kind of keep it all together just in case. Um, oh, that's okay. Don't worry about it, Heather. If you've got it, yay, Taryn's got number eight. Yes, this is the medallion med med uh, medley pattern. So look, you have these kind of, these little pockets right here that can hold a whole bunch. I just haven't really put all of mine in there yet. Then you've got, oh, you know what? Heather, if you're still here, you're here, right? Um. You've got these little things here that you can put either makeup in or pens. Another little pouch. And then right there in the middle, I love it. Yes, Medallia Medley is so pretty. Y'all, and people have been doing coloring parties. Speaking of parties, we need to have parties. I am so far behind for my month. Please, can we have some parties, especially some home parties? I want to have a home party so bad. I promise. And if we do a home party, I can almost guarantee you, you're going to get so many hostess gifts. It's ridiculous. Mm-hmm. Okay. Look, check it out. I love this guy. Swap it pocket. You need it in your purse. What you do, you put it in your purse. And then when you're ready to switch purses, you take it out and you swap it like a pocket. Whatever. You know what I mean. Anyway. It's great, I love it. That's a perfect gift for any lady in your life. Swap It Pocket is, I don't know how many dollars, I didn't write it down. Okay, so let's go next. Number six, anybody need number six? 
Oh, Paula, you got one. Good. See? The swabber pocket's where it's at. I'm not lying. Okay, number six, ladies. All right, now we're talking. This is where I wanted to get the zipper pouch. This is a November special. So, just like we talked about with the Zout, for every 35 you spend, you get that one for 10. The zipper pouch, you get this one. You got it? What'd you get, Taryn? What'd you get? Did you get bingo? Okay. Um, so, thank you, Taryn. So, this one, um, for every 35 you spend, it's only $5.00. And these are originally 15, so it's, uh, it's a steal again. The inside is wipeable, which is really nice. And look at this, do you see? Look at that. I mean, if only I could show you all the junk without dumping it all out, you would be impressed. And look, you see how big it is? Look, it's huge. Yo, these are great. You can fill this stuff full of maybe like the, you have kids and you're gonna go on road trips put all their stuff in this one and then they're good to go and they have their own bag um or i don't know like oh my cat is sitting in one of my things right now <laughs> um anyway or, or maybe you have a dog and you need to put all your dog stuff in here so you have something to take with you you can even get a little wristlet and put it on this this is a great gift for anybody in your life okay so 19 23 um, one, three, nine. I'm looking for you, Heather. Hold on. Hey, y'all. Miss Heather has a bingo. Heather has a bingo. Yay! Awesome. Praise Jesus. Josh said, praise Jesus. Did you hear him? Hmm. He doesn't want to do this anymore, does he? No, it's okay. You can leave him here. Or, I mean, on the on the, the second post. That's fine. Because I, I think you missed the very first one. So, no worries, girl. It's good. Okay. So, Heather, you won. We're going to talk here in a second. I'm going to send you a message on Facebook. Um, all right. So, who had, um, who was only missing one number? Do I have anybody who was only missing one? Oh, 15%. Okay, well, I'm wrapping it up, I promise. Who only had one number? Hmm? Anybody? Bueller. Reagan only had one number. Taryn, how many do you have left? Only missing number four. Oh, Kimberly. Okay. Hold on. I'm gonna type to you real quick. Let's see. Priscilla's missing two. Paula needed three. Okay. Carol, you're missing six out of the eight? Uh-uh. One, two, three, four. Wow. Okay, so Kimberly was only missing one, and Taryn was missing three. All right, girls, I tell you what, but you're going to have to hold yourselves accountable, okay? All of you that played, I want you to send me a message, and I'll send you a little prize, okay? And then... Oh, you're missing number four. Yeah, you're only missing one, right? Okay. All of you who played, send me a message. It's up to you, and I'll send you a prize. But, Miss Heather Reynolds, I will send you, um, I'm going to send you a message, and you'll get our grand prize, okay? And we'll discuss what that is in our message. Um, Kimberly, you better send me a message. I know how you roll, and I know you're not going to, but you better do it anyway, okay? All right. So, um, ladies, let's book some parties, okay? Because Christmas is going to close out. Uh, the, the cutoff date to get your stuff in for Christmas is the 12th. Um, I would love to come hang out with you, especially at your house, if you'll make me some brownies and show everybody all this good stuff, okay? It would be so much fun. You know it would. 
Yeah, Kimberly knows. I think I had to beg her to send me something, like, I, to send me her address the first time. Mm-hmm. Do it. Okay, so, y'all, let's book parties. Send me messages. Let's have a good time. If you want to do a Facebook party, that's okay, too. Um, I just, or maybe we need to go, like, just have a party on the go. And we'll go hang out, have a cup of coffee, and we'll get this shindig done in, like, an hour. Okay? Tamara makes brownies. Tamara, you come to Midland, and we'll have the party at my house with all your people. Let's do that. Yes. No, 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 but you have to make that pie, that pie that you loved. Okay, or that you make. Anyway, y'all, I think I have woman. You better send it. <laughs> y'all, my mother-in-law just sent me, sent me a message. Said a message. Carol, you make me laugh. I'm so glad you're my mother-in-law. What kind of brownies? See, look, Priscilla will come. She'll come to the party if you make brownies. All right. Y'all, thank you so much for a good time. I've really missed seeing you and hanging out with you. Thank you so much for um, really, I mean, like, it's been an awesome two months in the 31 business. So I love you. Y'all are a lot of fun. Welcome, Taryn, to the party. Welcome, Candace, to the 31 sisterhood. Um, yeah, it's going to be awesome. All right, girls. Have the best night ever. I'll talk to you soon. Kathy. Josh totally needs a hobby. Let's find him one that's not poking me with arrows. All right. Haha, <laughs> yes. Plain old chocolate's good. Okay, all right, girls. And Jason, I'll talk to you all soon. Have a good night. Uh, next Tuesday, I'll see ya. Bye.